Israel has directed decimating airstrikes in Gaza on New Year's Eve in the wake of asserting that Iranian shells arrived in its region. The two evenings of airstrikes focused on a Hamas position in southern Gaza late Saturday, as per the Israeli military. Right.com reports, while Israeli Defense Minister Avigar Lieberman said it's too soon to name those at fault in the assault, he immediately pointed the finger at Tehran for the occurrence. Iran has provided these rockets to various gatherings, Lieberman revealed to Israeli media, saying that an underlying examination of the shells discharged affirms they are from Iran. The Iranian administration keeps on taking a chance with the well-being of the inhabitants of the Gaza Strip and places them in grave peril. Wherever the Iranian administration works or is included, it just wreaks devastation and demolition, the IDF tweeted after the assault. The IDF additionally blamed Iran for intentionally inciting the Palestinian-Israeli clash through its intermediaries, rebel and radical psychological oppressor gatherings by piping arms to them trying to reignite slowed down threats following quite a while of calm. Scolding Iran, Lieberman seemed to pile on common acclaim on Hamas for avoiding direct military encounter, claiming that the gathering could never again monitor different minor arrangements that are in charge of the spike and strains. Hamas is being cautious since they don't need war, as we don't, however the Salafist and radical Muslim gatherings are following up on their own. The pastor, known for his hawkish perspectives, revealed to Hadashit News in a meeting. The shelling occurred Friday evening and brought about no losses. It was accounted for that two of three shells were either blocked by Israel's Iron Dome against rocket framework or fell in non-local locations. One shot, in any case, allegedly harmed a working in the Negev locale flanking the Gaza Strip in an immediate hit. The Israeli Defense Forces IDF, said it reacted by focusing on Hamas stations in northern Gaza with tank fire and airstrikes. The shelling and retaliatory strikes comes in the midst of savage agitation in the Israeli-possessed Palestinian domains in the wake of U.S. President Donald Trump's choice to perceive Jerusalem as the Israeli capital on December 6. The questionable move drew far-reaching global judgment, applaud from the Israeli experts, and incited requires another Palestinian uprising a favored intifada against Israel and Washington. A flood of fierce conflicts between Israeli troops and Palestinian nonconformists in the marginal regions of the West Bank and Gaza Strip followed. No less than 14 Palestinians have been murdered and nearly 3,000 harmed as Israeli powers over and again discharged live ammo and elastic shots to focus on the instigators and suppress the distress. Tehran which has been progressively inconsistent with both U.S. and Israel, joined the ensemble of those impugning the Jerusalem move, with Iran's defense minister, General Amir Hitami, contending, that on the off chance that anything, it would hurry the decimation of the Zionist regime. Iranian administrators as of late affirmed a bill that would require its legislature to perceive Jerusalem as the capital of Palestine. Iran's help for Hezbollah which is battling along President Bashar Assad's armed force in Syria and has added to the destroying of the Islamic State, is, once ISIS, ISIL, psychological militant gathering in there, has additionally since quite a while ago irritated Israel. The IDF as often as possible struck military focuses in Syria, referring to the need to forestall arms exchanges to Hezbollah. Tel Aviv claims Tehran is attempting to secure a dependable balance in Syria to assault Israel with PM Benjamin Netanyahu fighting that Iran shares Nazi Germany's heartless responsibility regarding murdered Jews. Another waiting purpose of conflict is the noteworthy Joint Comprehensive Plan of Action JCPO Atomic Arrangement, which has over and over been hammered by Tel Aviv and Washington as intrinsically imperfect. The U.S. and Israel additionally said the historic point ascension will empower Iran to keep seeking after its atomic program and create WMD in spite of Tehran's affirmations that their atomic desire are altogether tranquil. The UN's Atomic Guard Dog, the International Atomic Energy Agency IAEA, has on various events affirmed that Iran is in full consistence with the multilateral understanding.